Scott Favour is looking to leave the trouble behind and welcome back a Wallaby selection. He's now played for the Reds, the Brumbies, the Force and is now set to return to his birthplace, New South Wales. It's another fresh start, but this one will be career defining. Back home after nine years on the road, Scott Favour is a new man. So relaxing at the moment that, you know, I'm hoping that transfers into, into my rugby and, you know, hopefully we'll see, you know, a, a guy that runs out there not, not feeling 32 years of age, but like as I feel, I feel like I'm 26 again. After being granted an early release from the Western Force on compassionate grounds, Favour is back in Sydney training with the Waratahs. In some ways I can sleep a little better because like some of a lot of the issues that I had over there um, still played on my mind and it's, it's amazing how now that I've left I've just relaxed so much. He made headlines at the Commonwealth Games when he was knocked out during the Sevens tournament. The headache got even worse in Perth in the papers for all the wrong reasons including drunken behaviour and the mistreatment of quokkas. Scott's put the binge drinking and off-field dramas behind him, wife Sarah and daughter Poppy, a massive motivation. You have to be happy, like number one in our life is obviously family and um, you've got to be happy in your, within your own life and everything before you can produce on the field and I, I can't imagine him going backwards from here, it's, he's so happy. When he runs out for the Waratahs, he'll become the first player to represent every Australian Super Rugby team. It's grown on me and I sort of looked at it from the perspective that, yeah, the same thing, I'm coming home. And at 32, that's where he'll stay. His two-year contract with the Tars likely to be his last. But a 